Hey guys, it's me, Jocasta Lester. In this video, I want to talk to you about something that's, um, it's sobering. I believe that there may still be secret Tuskegee experiments as well as Hitler type experiments. Think about this. Before Tuskegee, there were, there were the uh, Nazi experiments, okay? Eugenics. I believe that and basically the Tuskegee program was a form of eugenics. So with that stated, I believe, and from my perspective, from what I've observed, and I want to get back to talking about the kingdom of heaven, by the way. <laughs> I believe that they're, they are performing secret Tuskegee experiments on people. And I believe that the way to identify a disenfranchised city or sets of cities is the high number of people who receive government services. So whether it be TANF, welfare, um, which is welfare, um, social security insurance, so oh, I'm sorry, supplemental security income, which is social security, so SSI, um, different programs where they are paid by the government to basically survive in the stead of working their own job. When you see a high prevalence of people who rely on public assistance, I believe those are the cities where they found a spiritual safe haven to be evil to people in a systematic and systemic way. I think they found a way not only to um, vaccinate people and to do their different experiments. But I, I believe that they found a way to secretly do it in the open such that people don't care in some cases because they're like, well, they're just welfare moms. They're just loony, loony tunes. So I say all of that to say this, repent for the kingdom of heaven is at hand. I believe that in these cities where there are a lot of poor Black people, poor white people, poor different subjugated classes. When there is a city where the number of um, people who are on public assistance is high, and not just numbers by numbers, number of cases, but percentages. There are cities where nearly the whole city is on welfare. <laughs> so... Repent for the kingdom of heaven is a hand. Have a blessed and marvelous day. You guys take care.